Hey, beautiful. You be G. Good for you. What? The Fortnites? Game reviews? The Unlimited Bits podcast? None of those ring a bell? <laughs> hey, welcome back to the UBG for our new gameplay series, The Combatants! Didn't really think too hard on the title for this one, so I just went with something simple that's just an easy reference to the series. I'm a long time fan of Mortal Kombat, have been since I was first introduced to the series with Trilogy on the PlayStation back in the early 2000s, and I love MK9 and MKX, and so here we are! And with this new first offering from yours truly, you'll see this guy that you might know of if you've ever played online MKX. Goes by the name of No Mercy, but it's written in typical try-hard cancerous fashion with no regard for the rules of the English language whatsoever. But I guess that respect for it was traded in for thousands of matches in online MKX because this guy has destroyed the guys and I on a few different occasions. And I like it when he joins one of our lobbies because he's claimed in the past that he gets hammered half the time he's on, but I suspect it might be more than just alcohol and he probably hits the bath salts and cocaine HARD! But we unfortunately can't witness any of that in this video because apparently MKX doesn't record in-game chat audio. Such a shame. So instead, I had to try to work with what I have and added in a voiceover. I haven't watched this in a few weeks, so it's all fresh to me again. And hey, it's new to you because you had never seen it before. But I've gone on for long enough. I'm not again showing footage in which the guys and I don't win and get brutally raped. So without further ado, let's do further. Here we go. Son of a bitch, I already lost the first round to this guy. But look at me, look at me with my Goro. My Goro. At first, I don't start out so hot. I remember I did some damage in the first round, but since I didn't have the entire first round, I didn't save it. I had to cut out the bit that was in there. Make this start out. Look at that, look at that. He's fucking whipping my ass. Ooh, ooh, ooh. He thinks he's all that. He thinks he's all that. Yep. Doing this classic fucking. Well, now classic to us, because we know them now. Look at that, look at that. Boom. Get him, pick him up. Boom, boom. He dodges the fucking ground pound. But I get him. Look at that. Get him. Boom, boom, boom. He doesn't block that third hit. Then I get him with his combo. Nobody uses his fucking combo. Boom. And then he gets me with the fucking x-ray. I mean, he was going to beat me anyway, most likely. So I don't, I don't remember that I've ever eaten no mercy, son of a bitch. Uh, but maybe someday. I've beaten... Um, the guys like to call them tryhards, and now the, the word has become familiar to me as well. And I'm like, I don't like how it sounds. I don't like using it! It's not my kind of word. It sounds, um, kind of whiny, to be honest. But, when you come across so many in MKX, because that's the norm, you know, what What, what can you do? And, uh, and, and they are the norm. And MKX, I, I've told this to the guys before, uh, the ratio of, of people that have played thousands and thousands of matches, the quote-unquote tryhards, and the people that haven't played as much, like me and the guys, uh, you know, is very, uh, <laughs> very unbalanced. You can't go a day without coming across people like this in this fucking game. Unlike an MK9, where you recognize a small handful of people that played like these guys, uh, and as long as you avoided them, you were good. They, they weren't, they, they were a lot more rare than they are in this game. Look, look at this guy, watch, watch, watch No Mercy. No, this guy playing Shinnok, what's his name? Medgar2013, what a fucking name. Um, he actually puts up a, a good fight, a decent fight. I don't remember if it was in this round or in the second one. I think he beats him in the second one. Yeah, watch, he's, he's getting hammered right here. Like, No Mercy, like I said in the intro, ah! I'm so funny. Yep, he got him. He took like half his health. Not a bad, uh, not a wet, not a bad way to kick off a fight, I don't think. Look at that! Look at that shit! I hate it when the fucking action stops for a second or for a good handful of seconds because somebody needs a goddamn love. Hope that's not a damn MK11. Look at that shit! Look at that shit! Fun. Make that comeback! Make that comeback! Yes! Shinnok, I swear to god, Shinnok is, is an annoying fucking character. Most people, the very few people use Shinnok, but when they do, they usually spam the gay fireworks, they usually spam the bone hands. And he's not using the variation with the bone hands here, where you can use a special attack to attack you from above or from below, and you have to fucking guess. You have to try to dodge that shit, or block it, and, and, and you can't block it a lot of the time because it's, it's, it's pretty unpredictable. 
unless the person that, that's using Shinnok isn't uh, very uh, unpredictable. So there you go, he made a comeback in the second round. Okay, fireworks, the staff, I hate that fucking staff. Shinnok doesn't have a lot of combos, uh, like combo combos. You can you can use the special attacks, right, to, to to make some combos with the special attacks, but actually just lone, you know, combo inputs, he doesn't uh, have that many. And since a lot of since the very since like ninety five percent of people don't use Shinnok, um, I don't get to see him often. I don't get to see what kind of creative shit people come up with. Because he's like an, a much easier Shang Tsung to use. Than fucking MKS. And Shang Tsung didn't have any fireworks. He just had his fucking fireballs. Both fireballs, right? And there you go, no mercy won. This whole thing is just gonna be no mercy winning. Spoiler alert. And it wasn't just me and and the guys that he that he destroyed. In this in this footage, and like I said, we played with him a a, a little handful of times when he's joined our lobbies. That's the thing. I don't think I think maybe once or twice I've joined a lobby that he's been in. But all the other times he's joined one of the lobbies that we, me and the guys have made. Except for like one or two times, that's always been the case. And every time we see him, that he's online, we're like, ah, oh, shit, what if he ends up joining our lobby? And most, and no, not most of the time, we'll say like half the time he does. We actually haven't played with him in a while. And uh, like I said in the intro, I actually don't mind playing with him. I know I'm going to get destroyed, but it's so fucking funny unless he's really chill because he seems to have, you know, uh, two modes. He's either really, really fucking chill and really, really quiet, or he's fucking hammered according to him. Like I said, probably the bad salt and cocaine and God knows what else. He's either really, really chill or he goes fucking apeshit and he's fucking... He's like a preacher if a preacher fucking trash talk non-stop without catching the breath. Like, no... No kidding, man. I mean, fuck. Look at this guy. This guy did absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Round two, here we go. Well, the combos, high combos, and then go low, low punches. Yep, the grab. That's Jax for you, and that's no mercies, fucking Jax. God damn it. Okay, shit, he's got him, he's got him, yeah. Yeah, this guy, wow. Worst performance yet, man. I mean, you're fighting a guy who's he uses a Jax for me. Look at, look at that, look at that! He's fucking ragdolling him like, like fucking... The Incredible Hulk in the first All Avengers the movie is what he did to Loki at the end of the movie. God damn. Jax wins. Yep. Flawless what victory. else is there? Ah, <laughs> he left the game. <laughs> I mean, fuck, maybe I would have the game too. Nah, actually, no. I never leave games. I usually, when I play with the guys, or even when I play by myself, I don't play King of the Hills when I'm by so myself. I tend to play one on ones. <laughs> Ranked one-on-ones because I feel like player versus player yes. matches are pointless. I like to practice in actual practice mode and then when I actually want to practice against a, a uh, opponent that's gonna fight back, then I do ladders. The classic ones. Those are those are still the best. We got all, this ta all these towers in MKX and I feel like the classic ones are the best. Even after, even after all these decades that this series has existed. Classic ladders are just still the best. Oh, I'm sorry, they're not ladders. They're towers in this game. And they're gonna be towers in MK11. If I remember correctly. Fuck, my bad. There you go. At least it's not a fucking revenant skin jack this time. Die nasty. I, I don't remember if we played against uh, this guy in the lobby after this footage. Cause this footage is a couple weeks old, old as of as of this voiceover, and I plan to upload this the same day that I uh that I um. That I'm done editing it right now, March, what is it? 30th or... Yeah, March 30th. There we go. Look at this guy. Not doing so hot. I think I remember when I first... When when when, when I saw this as it, as, it, as it was happening, that I thought, oh, look at that, he went fucking... Yoga instructor Sonia, PE teacher Sonia, so... Nobody uses Sonia in this game either, unless they actually know how to use her. And I believe I was very disappointed when I saw that uh, they did shit. I did better with my Goro. Goro is not a hard character to use, but but I mean I took I, I almost beat this guy twice. Two rounds. Two rounds, right? You remember that? 
beginning. Look at that ragdoll and Hulk and Loki style again. <laughs> that never gets old. Though. Even when it's being done to me. Look at that. Oh, oh, making a comeback. Never mind, never mind. I guess I misremembered. I guess I misremembered. Oh, shit. Okay, maybe I was wrong. I should have kept my mouth shut. I did not remember that this person actually went around. Because he did so shit in the first one. Alright. Not a bad comeback, not a bad comeback. Oh my god, those gotcha crabs. Look at that shit. Gotcha. Yep. Repeat of the first round though. Look at that. They didn't even touch him. Okay, except for the little toe tap right there at the end. <laughs> Damn, that's just sad. And then I believe, last but not least, Gordon, who you might have seen in the Fortnite episodes uh, as well. Oh, he loved fighting No Mercy, right, Gordon? Oh, your favorite fucking opponent, your BFF in MKX. No doubt. Ah, uh, if you guys could have only heard the, uh, the in-game chat for this. That's why I saved this originally. And then when I played it back on the PS4, I noticed that, oh, shit, even though we were in game chat, this doesn't record in game chat audio, which is a shame. Because Fortnite does it, I guess it apparently depends on the game. If that's not the case, uh, somebody who might know a bit more than me, because I've only had my PS4 for a couple of months and I don't tend to dig into the settings often. If there's a way to allow MKX to record in game audio, because I, I do have it, uh, I enabled it a couple of weeks back, but it doesn't seem to work for this title, uh, somebody let me know. Let me know. Because it makes me sad that you can't hear uh, uh, Gordon and No Mercy uh, tell each other how much they love each other <laughs> as the fight goes on. Uh, and even before the fight, I mean, if you looked at the at the name cards, you probably see the, the mics going on off, 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 and off, and off, and off. I was just laughing my ass off the whole time. Oh yeah, he actually went Kenshi in this one. I did not remember this. He went Kenshi in the Jax. <laughs> Great. Oh, that's tremendous. Gordon, fight back, Gordon. Gordon, fight back. No, he just ran towards him, grabs him. Zone him out. Yep, look at that shit. Look at that shit. Alright, but I think that Shinnok guy, uh, whatever his name was, Madith, whatever the fuck, and myself, we were the most worthy opponents against no person. No offense, Gordon, but it's the truth. <laughs> Kenshi's another one. There's so many characters. There's, what, 35 characters in this fucking game? Last time I checked. Plus, you know, all the variations. Which makes basically makes them, you know, different characters. Because they change some of their combos and stuff. There's all these characters, and you know you're going to have a quote-unquote tryhard when they use Melina, or Katana, or Kenshi, or Quan Chi, or Liu Kang, or Kong Lao. It's always the same little punch. They don't uh, dwell very much outside of that. <laughs> wins. Damn, Gordon. Uh, well, uh, I remember he was very happy <laughs> when he took him on in this fight. And we left Try after this because, uh, I mean, psh, you gotta know when to quit right after you got your ass handed to you a couple of times. So we left, and that's the end of this video.